Simple is without a doubt the star of Navi. Whether he's got a rifle or the op in hand, he's always a threat to pull off a highlight play and take over the server. Nitro does have a Molotov and another smoke, so it could be really rough for Simple to actually get through this. He's gonna throw the AWP in. Oh my god! Simple, what is happening? Sit double smokes in the same place there. Simple just jumping casually into the side. He's gonna fall down again. Oh! What is this part from? Simple, are you serious? What is that? You can't do that, Simple! Simple's spotlight often overshadows the performance of some of his teammates, but nothing that Simple did could hide Flamey's insane half against Quantum Bellator Fire. The E-League Boston Major was historic for many reasons, the obvious being Cloud9's crazy run to win the tournament. Guardian waits patiently as Cloud9 sets the push up. Oh! Oh, it's happened! They made it work! Cloud9 are your E-League Major champions! Backtracking to the quarterfinals, Navi had a match against the heavy underdogs in Quantum Bellator Fire. The best of three started on Mirage, and it looked like Simple would lead the way for Navi as he picked up three scout kills in round two. But this wasn't the Simple show. The real man of the hour showed up in round four. Okay, getting picks with Glocks is not very realistic, and Flamey's in position to deny them. Very nice spectacle here from Flamey with that 4K off the AK-47, just warming up. Through four rounds, Flamey already had nine kills to his name. It seemed like every round, Flamey would pick up at least two kills. He turned trade situations into straight up double kills. As Quantum Bellator Fire continued to attack the bomb site, it seemed like Flamey was often the last line of defense. And QBF simply couldn't crack it. Trade, but it's buying time for the CTs to rotate. And then gets his bell rung, and there he goes. Flamey now trying to finish things off. Water falls on low health, 30 HP. Flamey will avoid the flames and bring QB5 to their knees once again. Flamey's kill count was now at 17, and he wasn't even close to being finished. Over the next two rounds, he picked up six more kills, including yet another 4K at the A bomb site. Round 11, with Navi up 9-1, Flamey continued his complete and utter dominance over QBF. He may go back, they may send more people towards the B bomb site, but the bomb is soon on the way, and all the T's making plays are quite telling Flamey is invincible. With 26 frags, he had more kills than all of Quantum Bellator Fire. Then Navi began to run the double op setup, where things got even more ridiculous. And they may feel afraid to run their own game. Flamey's been given AWP. He's got new toys to play with. Christmas has come again for Flamey. 29 kills in 12 rounds. Flamey was just one kill away from breaking the major record for most kills and a half. And not surprisingly, he found it in the very next round. Now Waterfalls is left with no Kevlar, a mid P250, and against Flamey in 1v1. That's not very fair. Surprise! And we have it, 30 bomb. Absolutely unbelievable. In 13 rounds, he has 30 frags. Flamey would add two more frags in round 14 to make his total 32. With that, Flamey had broken Broken Edit's world record for most kills in a half. Flamey finished the half with an absurd 5.33 KDA and an average damage per round of 188.3. Although it didn't add to his new record, Flamey ended the map with 39 kills as Navi absolutely dismantled QBF. Nearly two years later, Flamey's record lives on and it's going to take a gargantuan effort to best his half kill record of 32.